as well as the standard fair use policy, this video is protected under the Treaty of Peace and Friendship, 1787. Moors are awake. We are taking our place on this planet. Okay. First and foremost, so I now I can talk. So y'all turned it off first, right? Right. Y'all touched my property, right? Absolutely. You work for the uh, state, right? Huh? And you I don't work for the state. Okay. Well, you work well, for we the city. Say city. So you work for the I city, work for which the city. works for the state. So, yeah. police so you touched my private property. Sir, I asked We're you to turn it off. I'm just saying it for the record. It off. I said I could, but I wasn't because I, I can hear you. Okay, so you clearly despite his instructions. But I can hear you. Got it. Right. And oh, then when I asked you to, you said just ignore it. Okay. So, Santa Monica Police Department, the city. Why are you walking up on me? Because I have a right to be here. It's a public space. I have a right to be right here too. Okay. Well, That's good. And there's no problem with that. We didn't tell you that. Well, I'm telling you. So let me ask you. Real quick. Okay. Okay. And then all of you are walking up like y'all gang or something. So you told me y'all have y'all. Um, they're here also. So I need to know this. Listen to him. This is a go to court. We're just here for four people now. That's one. Okay. So who's the supervisor? All right. All right. All right. Wait, 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 everybody, everybody, let me speak. Are you okay? a supervisor? Yeah, because he's trying to speak. He's trying okay, to speak. Okay, okay, let's go down. Let's, let's start over. What's your business? What's your name? I'm Officer Madrid. Yeah, I have your badge now. 3959. Man, I have your business card. I don't have a business card. What's your name? Are you doing business All out right. here? Are we going to be reasonable or not? We're going to go by the law. I just want to calm it down. We're going to go by the law. What's your first name? What's your first name? I'm sorry. Okay. No right to All right. Me, We're not going to play the name game. Yet. All right. You're so let already. me let me just explain to you real quick. Are you recording? Let me. I'm recording. We're all recording. We're all recording. So. All right. Let well, me, let me ask the question. No, 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 no. Because you no, no. approached us. Right. Yes. yes. Wait, 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 wait. Everybody, everybody, everybody. You have a business license to be here. Ace. One second. You're disturbing people. One second. One second. We are both police officers. They are code enforcement. Which is the lowest ranking officer in the United States. They are code enforcement officers. Currently, there's. I'm not under any code. We're not under no codes. There's an issue with code enforcement. We are here just to uh, help them out. All right. So this is code enforcement. This isn't a police matter at this moment. So speak with them. You guys. I'm speaking to you, yes. city municipality. Oh, now you're out of. It. Now we're not. They now are. They are code enforcement. We're not under just maritime air control. It is a joke this because joke. you're playing games. This Speak with the code enforcement officer. All right. Constable. So, my name is Asel Travel. Who's the I'm supervisor? So, X three times. Let me see. You guys are vending ICs down I'm not a vendor. Call your Shave supervisor, vendors. please. Shave I'm not ice. a vendor. No shit. These more sovereign citizens got to be some of the silliest people on the planet. The code enforcer officer or whatever he is just said that these guys are vending ices on the beach and more sovereign citizen yells out i'm not a vendor well no <laughs> fool which is why they are there because you are not a vendor and you need a vendor's license to sell stuff in the public so you just admitted to not being a vendor, and that's exactly why they are there. So that should be the end of the conversation. No more arguing. You just admitted that you're not a vendor, which is against the law. If you are trying to sell things on a public park or wherever they had a beach you must have a vendor's license so being that you just admitted that you're not a vendor that should be the end of the conversation pack up your stuff and go on don't ask them no questions i see dollar signs here for large shaved icy with fruit that is an advertisement a dollar is gold and silver Wrong. This guy is fucking stupid. Okay, so and who are you with again? Who are you guys with? Who I'm with I'm code enforcement. The, the, city code of, enforcement. the city of Santa Monica. I'm not the city of Santa Monica. You're you're vending in the city of Santa Monica. And, and where who, who, so, who runs first, the city of Santa Monica? You do? Um, I don't. But but uh, you're enforcing employed, their law. But I'm employed by the city of Santa Monica. All right, let me see to your badge number, please. Uh, I'm right here. All right, you have a business card. I do have a business okay. card. Okay, he said he didn't have one. Well, he's your supervisor. And I want your business card. You have no right to my business card. But you have a 
have no right to our private property. And our this is not private property. This is public land. All of this is private. And this is America. The last time I checked, my ancestors were born here. The last time I checked, my ancestors were born here. Really, right in this spot. Right in this land. Right in this spot. Come on, man. We can be reasonable here. You guys are being completely unreasonable. I'm a Native American. I'm a Native American. This is actually Hey, guys. You want to go there. No sense. You want to go there. No sense thing. This is my land. You don't have olive skin and wood. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. wow. This is my land. Wow. You want to go there? Okay. You want my land. Paper bag test. Let's not go there. Man can't be bought us up and on the This is my land. My people have been here for thousands of years, all right? So by this conversation, I can take it you guys don't have a business like this. Oh, we're bonded. Never heard of them. Just like you guys are bonded, we're bonded. You're bonded? Yeah, just like you guys are. Bonded? Bonded? Can you spell that for me? No! These more sovereign citizens are making a complete fool of themselves, as usual. These officers are here because they are selling things on the street and they're not vendors or don't have a vendor's, vendor's license. And these guys are talking about I'm Native American, this is my land, last time I checked, this is our land. These guys really need to stop it and it's funny that they bumped into an officer who's actually a Native American and he is totally owning these fools. Like, why in the doohickey are you even bringing up anything concerning Native Americans? You vending in the park has absolutely nothing to do with your ancestors or where they are from. No, no. you bother. You, you can't know spell that. You can't. I'm trying to. I'm trying to no, understand trying what to this word funny. is. Yeah, I'm not being funny at all. Let me talk to so who sent you. So do you have a business license? Let me talk to who sent you. Because you have a not talking I don't about have to. That. I'm not vending here. I don't sir. have to. Okay. So in America, I, I guess at this point, I guess at this point you need to call your supervisor. Yeah, because you do anything. We're gonna obviously confiscate whatever's oh, going on here. If you don't have a business license, you're gonna rob us now. I'm not robbing you, sir. I'll give you a property tag. With everything that's confiscated, you can come back in on Tuesday morning. No, you're not going to steal anything. And then you can get it all back. I'm not stealing no, anything, sir. I'm not talking. All right, cool. Here's the law. All right, cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. I'm not sure if you guys noticed, but this more sovereign citizen is on the phone with his grand sheik as if his grand sheik can help the situation. These guys love calling their grand sheiks when they have some type of police contact. And these grand sheiks never help. All, all they do is make things worse by giving bad advice. And these Morris fools actually follow their bad advice. So I take it you don't have a business license. I I'm being a criminal. Absolutely. Okay. You're disturbing the peace. So, do you have a license? And I need a business card. You don't have business cards. Business license with the city? I don't have a business card. I'm being recorded right here. Speak up like a man. Speak up. Hey, where's your business card? I don't want to talk no more. Where's your business card? No, where's your business card? Do you have your business license? Where's yours? I'll show you mine. Well, then go ahead. If you're not showing me yours, leave. Simple as that. Call your supervisor. We're not leaving. Yes, we're not going to be leaving there, sir. We're not leaving. This is not a police you matter. You said Well, if it's not a police said, matter, what are you doing? It's a code enforcement matter. Code enforcement. Well, we're not under maritime admiralty. Oh, my goodness. Yo! I need Google for Google Pops! We don't know about maritime admiralty. Yeah. Obviously, he doesn't. You don't either. You're constable. Everything so y'all saying is foreign state. to us. We're not horses. All right? I never we're said it was a stable. Now. All right? I didn't say stable. That's a word that you are using. Mr. Not Agent. Give me your business card. Your I don't have a business card. In your coat of ethics. Is your machine on? I don't see the button. Wait, I don't need it. You don't, yeah, you don't even know how to operate this camera. You have a gun, a weapon on your hip. That's an international violation. You're a criminal right now. Are you stupid or something? That's why you yeah. need to take that up with yeah. the city of California and the U.S. That's government. Well, tell the city of California to come talk to us about this matter. 4050. Because y'all work for the city. Why does he have one you don't have because he's code enforcement. I am not code enforcement. I am the Santa Monica Police Department. Let me see the law. Show me the law. 
So what we you don't need a supervisor for what you doing? We work in conjunction with code enforcement. And new uh, codes so and policies, those are not law. It's within a city, so we all collaborate to work together. Uh, That's kind of how this works. That's kind of how it works? Yeah. And who are your subjects? Did you see it? No. I don't understand that. Okay, so uh, let it be known that uh, we have tried to issue uh, the venue information. Well, can vendors. I get all of you guys' information? And if you're so called no, native American, I know I want you to be straight here. Basal trauma. No, I want every one of you guys to be right here. I'm going to give you a receipt for everything that you've got. I don't want to receive it. I want everything. Yes, you are. Unfortunately, you're not. Where is it? Right? Where's the city of Santa Monica? And you think you can put the value on their receipt? This is the city of Santa Monica. This is where? So you guys have to give me a hundred thousand dollar receipt. Uh, so all we're gonna be taking is anything that's perishable. So you're gonna have to give me a hundred thousand dollar receipt. Turf, I go I don't, I'm not I'm gonna, gonna, I'm gonna give you a flat. You know how much my property is worth? All right, get that straight. Hmm. Yes, I know how the Constitution oh, right. works. No right. with you. Huh? We the people, right to liberty. At this point, no need to engage in the You're a criminal. You're a criminal. Who sent y'all? Don't touch anything. If you're not a police officer, you can't touch Hey, listen, I will tell you this. If you put hands on code enforcement... I'm touching my property. Not, touch, I'm touch touching my property so they don't touch my stuff. So I'm not touching touch anything. Them, it's going to be hey, assault. You're going to be property. arrested. We, we're going to see. We're going to see. Don't yank stuff out of it. Well, don't touch my property. We're going to see. Now, now you guys are causing problems. And if somebody, the public, step on it, it's because of y'all. Do you have an idea? Do you have an idea? You never uh, gave me yours. I'm tired of talking to y'all. Okay, so how am I supposed to give you a property tax well, how, if you don't give well, me Well, you can't give me one, so leave. Yeah. I'm not leaving, sir. That's not going to happen. Well, they're standing so here, want, and I'm going to stay here. Y'all can sit recruit? right there on side of us if y'all yeah. want to, because the land want, is big enough for all of us. Want, they got a McDonald's on every corner. Oh, yeah. All right? Your ancestors came over here on the ship before 1774. Right, be known so y'all get it straight. I'm not stock. a vendor. We've given uh, him the vendor information. I am that I am. And he's got a, he's got a That's not a vendor. that's operating here. He's got dollar signs out. He's got merchandise. According Definite to the Constitution, definition of a vendor has only been real dollars go to silver. Ah, uh, I think the fuck not, you trick ass bitch. All right. Why are you saying this is a police matter? It's a public enforcement matter. I just disagree so, you. I, so all I'm saying, I'm not, not touching none of my property. property is what, what I'm trying to say. You can't explain it. Anymore. I mean, I'm pretty sure all y'all got, got families to raise with y'all job that y'all got. And if y'all want y'all job, I mean, y'all should go back and deal with some other people that may be breaking y'all codes. Because we're private. They're public. Y'all causing a scene for no reason. That's their favorite line of the defense. We're private. And the other people are public. So go mess with them. Sir, what in the doohickey are you talking about? That means absolutely nothing. Because now you the one of y'all never identified yourself. Y'all just said something. Hey, just hearsay. That's not real law. Let me see some documents. Y'all the ones that got the badge on. Y'all the ones that took the oath to uphold some type of law. Where's that law at? We the people. Who sent y'all? And then who do I take this ticket to? The judge? So the judge sent you? No, you go to this. The, if I can get your information, then I'll I just give told you the property you tag. And I'm not we in. <laughs> and then you can go to the, the city of Santa Monica. That's who I am. I am that I am. <laughs> Sir, do you want to listen to what I have to say? Are you foreign to me? Your president said he's not even worthy enough to be our slave. So how the lowest ranking officer you. can talk to us? Get it straight. Right. We was trying to be good with y'all at first, but now y'all didn't got us worked up. Well, this is the thing. You can't be doing what you're doing in Santa Monica without a license. Do so if, you, if you're, you're outside America, of Santa Monica... Do you understand that Yeah, I understand it's America. I understand you're in the boundaries. Do you understand the treaties of, and the Constitution? Oh, yes, I understand it. Okay. Understand it. That's do why you have understand right. that this is not commerce and trade? That's you have. Your, your, do you understand that we're private? Do you no, understand that this is my ancestors' land? You're public property. You can do that on private property all you like, sir. But this is private to me. Well, it was public whenever y'all got the mature. You are not freedom. the United States. You, you the Sorry. United States. I know I'm the not people, the United States. The people are not. I'm not the United not, States. Yeah, exactly. The United States is a corporation. If you look at the city of Santa Monica, where you're actually at, the property of Santa Monica.
you can't be vending without a business license. Listen, listen, listen. So, I don't care about none of that. I don't understand what you're talking about. All I know again, is so that you're breaking the, the law. Coming over here talking to the, I'm not the true one Americans. Any law, sir. Pretty much, pretty soon, we're going to teach every vendor out here what we're talking about, and then y'all won't be able to come out here at all. How about that? Welcome to the room of infinite bullshit! All right. Then y'all won't have a job. So I'm making my business to go around and get everyone paperwork straight. So y'all can't say where your license is. I'm making my business. Because they're in the commerce and trade. They're not private, but I go make them all private. I make they're them all private. private and then they'll be telling y'all the same thing I'm sitting here saying. Y'all don't want that. Y'all don't want every vendor on the street to start saying it. So what this Morris Sovereign Citizen numbskull is essentially saying is he's going to walk around the beach and invite the rest of the vendors to his cult. And I'm pretty sure those vendors are going to say, no, thank you. We do not want to join your cult. We see the foolishness that you're talking and we are good. We are not joining the Moorish cult. But that's what's gonna happen. Then y'all not gonna have a job because there ain't nothing to be in for. Gotcha. Gotcha. See? I'll play that game. So then when it's your turn to play, you wanna play. You got it. I don't know what y'all talking about. I'm foreign to all of that stuff y'all talking about. So are we gonna call this game? What are we gonna do? I'll tell y'all what. Y'all can't take the living flesh and y'all can't take this body. So everything that's out here is attached to me. Everything out here is bonded with me. And according to the Treaty of Peace and Friendship, it said that we're not in these war times right now because I'm telling you I'm private. And it's saying that any of my property comes back to me. So you can't touch my property. You work for the corporation. So it'd be best if y'all just went on. Because all of y'all took an oath to something to get your job. All of y'all signed some type of contract. Did y'all read the fine print? Hmm? You were being loud with your generator once we got around sleep. Listen, you being loud sitting there talking. Yeah. Ain't no one touching them. No one. You just put hands on me. So y'all should be done. Y'all just assaulted. It's documented on the camera. It's documented on the four cameras here. Who broke the glass? I dropped it, but who broke it? Y'all did, because y'all came over here. No, uh, messing with private them. people because before we was over here it wasn't broken because if y'all wouldn't have started grabbing stuff it wouldn't have broke oh i got it recorded don't worry i ain't got to go back and forth with y'all nobody here's a supervisor so let me go ahead and run my documentary because as y'all can see we are the true americans and we have every right under the Constitution to be out here to oh, vote to what we have. No one's more American than me. Listen, that's just what you say. You want to go that direction. Let's look at the book. I can play that. You want to do a blood test? Nobody's more American. But again, this is not a language. You might be a little Spaniard. You want to talk about this language. You might be a little Spaniard or something like that. You're a little, uh, I see black people blood all over this place. You're a little amalgamated. Now. But, you know, well, what it is. We, we, genocide but, genocide. But, but we really are brothers. And, we all are brothers. We want to talk about but that. Listen, don't go there. Listen, going down the wrong road. We're all Asiatics. Wrong. We're going down the yeah. wrong road. Listen, we're all Asiatics, yeah. right? Yeah. And that's the problem. Welcome yeah. to my land. Welcome. We keep saying this is not a police matter. Not a police matter. I explained it to you three times, and you said you don't understand. So I can't explain it to you any other way. I don't have to explain it to you. And then y'all turned off my generator. My stuff is getting flipped over here. Y'all ain't explaining nothing on nothing. What is the code enforcement? Go into the American Constitution and show me one code. So what are y'all enforcing? Thank you.
Nay, we true Americans. I just told you that. We're not solving shit. True Americans. Excuse me, sir, but you are, in fact, a sovereign citizen. And I'm glad the officers are able to identify that you are a sovereign citizen. That one that was here before your ancestor. That part. Here's law. Smile for the camera, Officer Melendez. 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 Not Melendez. And why are you here again? I told you we're here. Assisting code enforcement. All right. So we're here. This is officer. This is not a police matter. Not a not police a matter. matter. Are you a police so officer? Y'all do a criminal matter. Then if it's not, y'all not even saying who's in charge. We're here to make sure it doesn't turn criminal. That's why. Is, is that a bad number? I didn't yanking. say it was. I didn't and say it was. When you start yanking stuff out of code enforcement, yeah. yeah. Can you give me some space, please? Can you give me some space? You're in my personal space. I need you to back up. Oh, uh, assault. Assault. I need you, you just to back assaulted. up. No, I need you to get out of my you space. just assaulted. I have a gun on my hip, and I don't want you near it. Right. So back up. Right. So you, you immediately have a, a weapon. Well, if you're the wise man, back up. If you feel like he's he going to He came into my space. Well, you the wise man, I'm a police officer. If he gets close to me, I will place him under arrest. Uh oh, he said if I get close to him, he's going to place me under arrest. Well, can I have your business card? No. Now I can't have his business card. Officer Madrid, 39. Officer Madrid, 3959. That's your badge number? What's your code? What is your code of ethics number? I don't have a What is your bond number? I told you, What is your bond number? I told you, it's 3959. That's your bond number? Oh, all right, all right, all right. That, his name is Officer Madrid. Officer Madrid right here. He has a weapon on his hip. That is an international violation. This, this constable over here also has a weapon on his hip. International violation. You're retarded. It's going to be your last time working. I've been out, I've been out saying, hold on, turn that generator off if you are trying to be What's a dog. I need you to back up. International you violation. I don't me. appreciate you. This public, like you told us, how is it your yeah, space? That's that part. Right in my face. I didn't get in your face. You've been in our face all day. No, I did it. What are you talking about? No, I did it. I keep backing up. You keep going. Come on, liar. Don't be a liar, too. You guys are liars. Don't be a liar, too. Liar. Professional. But you already know. You got his gun on him. You got his hand on his weapon. International violation. It's the last time you're going to work. Yeah, they shaved ice. They got fruit. Remember that face. Remember that last. I'd be rich. Yes, Officer Madrid 3959. Uh, what's your what's your name again? Officer Officer Melendez, what's your badge number again? I gave it to you like five times. Uh, on camera, please. I gave it to you five times. Oh, he's not, he not seeing me. We can get it. Uh, he's saying he don't have to. I didn't say that. He's very I gave it to you five times. All right. And it's on documented on my body worn camera that you can publicly ask. Or public you, can go through the you have a responsibility to give up your information. I gave it to you. Anytime I, I ask you, I'm asking you again. I gave it to you already five times. You're not going to give it to me six times? I gave times? it to you five times already. How about I gave six? It to you five times. All right. Still international violation. You know? He has not given up any of his credentials yeah, as a constable. You should learn something. So All right. You this one, this one as well. This one is very belligerent. You should know that we use. This one is very belligerent. Just international you violation. Today, you're going to see us again. I'm going to make sure I come back out here. This is a code enforcement officer, whatever that is. He's out here. He's a criminal as well. I don't see any particular weapons on his hip, but he has disturbed the peace. This one here as well. All right. They're obstructing justice and they're disturbing the peace. Obstruction of justice and disturbing the peace. Obstruction of justice and disturbing the peace. International violation. You're a criminal right now. And you will answer for it, all of you. Guarantee. You don't know who the Moors are, so called Native Americans. What tribe you from? You don't even have a tribe, but you're Native American. No, he's fur. He, Native American. he said he is too. 
Oh, and the Yahweh. Yeah. Which you taught that to Maya? Which one? That part. Which one are you? You don't even know what language you speak. Look at it. You from the Chahokopi? Look at it. You said you're 10,000 years old on this land. Chahokopi is 4,500. Were your ancestors, were your ancestors you police Asino? officers? Because the Sino, they go back 3,000 right here. That's it, only 3,000. Which one are you from? Only 3,000. I don't appreciate your discriminatory remarks. I'm saying I study. Because you're talking about we're speaking the truth. So I don't want to talk about we're my speaking truth. About we're speaking truth. Now you're talking about my family. We're so speaking truth. Now you're talking about my family. We're speaking so truth. So if you want to talk about the Miriam, you want to talk about the Tumiri, you want to talk about the Egyptians, if you want to talk about the Phoenicians, if you want to talk about the true Americans, they all are us. If you want to talk about the Phoenicians, if you want to talk about the true Americans, they all are us. Here, that's my ancestors. So you need some more. Uh, our, our story lessons today because the history that I've been taught European history from the same ones that enslaved they, they and know it. now you're standing up there proud jumping through hoops through them clothes that for, they for a school. corporation in one you're uniform and you saying that I'm disrespecting you you're disrespectful to your ancestors you're disgrace for working for them who enslaved your ancestors these two more sovereign citizens are some ignorant son of a what in the doohickey do these people's ancestors have to do with you illegally selling juices on the beach? It has absolutely nothing to do with that. So the fact that you're bringing that up, trying to make it seem like they're a disgrace because they're police officers, you are some ignorant as Moorish Americans. Neanderthal. You that's what you are. Neanderthal? Yeah, you're not a Native wow. American. You're Neanderthal. Oh, wow. wow, he's got better than you call me a dog early. Oh, wow. Is that what you are? Can you believe that? Yeah. You believe guys? Is that what you are? Yeah. You got fur on your hair. You got fur on your chest. And you got fur on your back. Neanderthal, not even huh. human. I'm not even human. Absolutely not. Wow. Is that right, sir? He's not on the business. Thank you. Uh, have a he's not he's not he's not giving it to me, Gracie. And he doesn't have it displayed either. Hey, just so you know, we're in the Neanderthals and he's a dog. Oh, this is a dog. Yeah. I just donated to me. Yeah, no, I'm just saying. That's, See, that's the kind of we the people, people no, we the people is always gonna be better than the corporation. Because y'all not with the good stuff. Not at all. Y'all on that lower vibration. Why is your badge number not displayed, though? Right there. And huh? you know, it was our brothers that put now up... Now, see your badge number. It wasn't the penalty. No badge number. We put our own self... You waste breath paper. to tell me that when you can just tell me again. Well, tell me again. As long as you... like this guy. That's how we get into slavery. Oh, absolutely. They know that already. I, I don't know what they're doing. I think they're trying to tow... Brother Wood sell conveyance and they trying to take our property that we have set up out here. I can't look at y'all property. Did y'all take my property out? Nope. Y'all got it. Right. Don't go through it. As plasma, you know, that's going to be uh, illegal in the state of Santa Monica, too. As long as you're captain. Oh, but y'all got correct training, huh? You called the police department for that. All right, he's it's telling me to call the police. police he said it's not a police matter, right? And you're taking it up with the wrong folks. Islam? That's what I told him. He's saying he's saying he's backing up the uh, the code enforcers. But it's not a police map. You need some uh But he already he already uh Officer Madrid assaulted me already. But y'all know what's good, right? You know what's good, right? Once we get finished with all of this, y'all gonna be the face to show the world. Islam, yeah, city of Santa Monica. Because y'all was the ones that came and provoked that energy to let the people see us stand up to y'all. So y'all gonna be the face to let everybody know that it's we the people in America. That's a good thing. So I can't say that y'all are too dirty. That's a good thing. First of all, you can't be all the way back. You can't be all the way good. I have no idea. We have no information on the other. 
that I think you can. Can you give a space? You keep coming in my face. I thought you were going to arrest me. I thought you were going to arrest me. This Morris fool keeps antagonizing this officer. It is very surprising that this officer doesn't just lock him up because that's what he would deserve. He deserves to be locked up. He's the one breaking the rules, and now he's antagonizing the officer for doing his job. If I were the officer, I would have just locked his behind up. You have a name and badge number? Yeah. Yeah, man. Thirty four seven one. Thirty four seven one. Gratitude. This line, Grand Street. Nay, we're close to Ocean and Broadway. Ocean and Broadway. Uh, they're on the phone and they're conspiring. It's about two of them. They're conspiring to do something. I don't know. Call the commissioner. Call the commissioner of Santa Monica. Hey, do you guys have the commissioner of Santa Monica's number? Y'all have the number to the commissioner? Something that pamphlet I give you. I gave you some information right there. You might want to check it out. Nah, I don't want to touch that because I don't accept that. But I'm talking man to man because you know that could be like I accepted a contract if I read that pamphlet. You're an idiot. Oh, um, we're going through it with the people right now, so we're going through it with the people over there right now, so yes, they're trying to say we ain't got an official to be out here doing business, but you know, this our ancestors' land, we are being here, they not official out here to come tell us anything. Right, that is crazy. So we just out here right now just holding our ground. They say y'all can't serve now either? Well, can't we- Can't about nothing? I really can, but I don't want to do nothing crazy because he already tried to jerk my stuff out of my hand. I had to jerk it back from him. They trying to oh, call some stuff. So right now we're at a standoff. They want to tow my truck. But I'm just trying to see what's going to happen. Well, really, I can do what I want. No, it ain't them. They ain't got nothing to do with our business. You get what I mean? Matter of fact, what you want? What you want? Uh, uh, what kind? Let me see. How much do you want? What you want? What flavors you got? Right now, what I got ready, I got uh, black blueberry, watermelon, peanut yeah, colada, yeah. cotton candy, just so that they're aware of what they're doing. So, so a lot of these vendors that are here, they have a health permit because they're serving food. But listen, this is my so, brother and sister. You see the color of their skin? Our me, ancestors let, 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 been here. Let me talk to them. We don't need no permit. Let me talk to them real quick. So, anytime you sell food. Anything because it needs to be the proper, you know, it needs to go to health department approval. That's the reason why a health, a health permit is required. Okay. Now, along with the city's Santa Monica business license, where a lot of these vendors do have them, right? They're able to sell food and stuff like that with the health permit. And you see it; they have it there. It's on the side of um, on the side there. Fortunately, the gentleman does not have that. Unfortunately, so we tell him. What ends up happening is, you know, we get concerns of people either getting sick and whatnot for stuff that they eat and stuff like that. So that's why we're telling these gentlemen, we give him a pamphlet to obtain the proper permit, and he's able to do this once he gets the proper permit. And that's all we're doing. So what I'm trying to tell them is our ancestors let them come over here in 1774 on the boat. And we ain't need no permits before then. So what you're talking about is cool for the pale-skinned Europeans, but it ain't cool for my brothers and sisters. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? Bro, I'm out, man. That nigga's tripping. Uh, you got that? 
Okay. You want to so, go I mean, that's, yeah. And so, it's basically up to whoever want to buy regardless, right? It's up to you, yes. Right, right, like, like, that's right, it. right, But, but right, for us, right, because, right, because right, we are the right, city, right, we have to right, tell right. people, exactly. this is the reason Reasons for why. that. Yeah, right. because then what ends up happening is, Without, no, get sick or something. without health permits, and, and I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you. Uh, I'm gonna show you a photo. Okay. This is the reason why. If, if, if it's not unpermitted, you you you, you get this type of shenanigans when you're buying hot dogs, you're buying stuff like this. We don't know what that. Yeah. He brought the thing inside the thing. Just now. I'm just saying. He said, "Dude, brought the whole thing inside." I'm just saying. Yeah. You see, it's very simple. All these officers are here doing is trying to protect the public from morons like this. They're just out here selling stuff. You never know what you're buying off someone from the street. These dudes might be serving stuff with salmonella. So they're just trying to help the public from getting sick if you go through the proper channels and get the permits it means you prove to the state that you know how to handle food and you're capable of selling things in the street without potentially getting someone sick that's it they're just trying to protect the public that's all nothing wrong with that but okay. then, you know, no, but, like, I, but you know, but I that, get but it. Like, right, 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 right. I feel where you coming from. I feel where you coming from too. I'm right. talking about, no, but no. like, like, like ice. I feel like ice ice probably, probably right. wouldn't be. It's bad. It's just like that's up to you because there is an ice one over there. Uh, that was a health permit that's on there. So I'm like, so okay, so what's the difference in the two? It's up to you. I I, I can't say. I'm just saying that that one we expected that one. That one we saw pretty. Let me tell you, he tried to tell us to learn our generator off too because the city of California, you know, whatever, said we can't run generators in the park. What you see going on right now? Generator running, and you see them right there standing there, right? So they could talk a bunch of uh, hopeless focus. It's up to y'all though. I'll give y'all one on. I'll give it to you on the strength, honestly. I'll donate it to y'all. Right, so you know. right, 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 right. Hey. I respect Honestly, I give it to you on the street just because of the fact we brothers. And they get mad. Nah, but I want you to make some money. Because look, we're going to make some money anyway. We just exactly. trying to do some uplifting thing for our temple. Right. So me and the brother came out here to get right. some stuff together. Exactly. And so, uh, exactly. and, we, that red hat. and we trying to right. and let the people know that we here. Right, exactly. Because everybody on the internet want to be fighting. They ain't really doing nothing doing for nothing. us. Right. You know what I mean? Right. Right. So today we're gonna try that tiger blood. We're gonna try two of those tiger blood, John. You right. Right. Dragon blood. What is called tiger blood? Dragon blood. Them tiger blood. They yep. go. They good though. Yeah. We try two of them. Good. Let me get you right. I look at it like this shit. Man, that's a lot of motherfuckers down here. I ain't got no goddamn money. Hey, what up? Hey, this is shit though. This is shit, 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 shit though. I'm just gonna say this. If you go right there on that pier over there, you got motherfuckers selling truck rolls. That shit ain't wrapped up. I ain't got no gloves on or any of that shit. And ain't nobody saying nothing. Right. Like, real facts. Right. 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 In the house. In the house. That's crazy. That's crazy. Let me go get my ice. All right. Oh, crazy. Oh, look, they're trying to talk my truck. Let me go stop them. Let me go stop them. Wait, wait, where your truck is? Right there. Let me go stop them on phase two. And you know why they're over there towing your truck right now? Because you have Morris license plates on it. Ladies and gentlemen, this is another prime example of why not to purchase internet license plates from any Morris publication. They are not legitimate and all that's going to happen is what is about to happen to this gentleman right here. Your vehicle will be towed and impounded and you're gonna have to pay fees to get it out and the fees that you're gonna have to pay to get it out 
cost more than the actual license plates that got your vehicle in there in the first place. So just do things the right way and register your vehicles within one of the 50 states and you will be able to avoid all of this foolishness. This is my property. Do not interfere. Back up. Hey. Do not interfere. Hey. No, no, come on, brother. I'm not listening. Hey, 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 hey. Do not hey, interfere. Hey, hey. Bag up, brother. Hey, hey, hey. Do not hey, interfere. interfere. You'll be come placed on. under arrest. Come this come is my on. private come property. On. Put me under arrest. Then I'm going to talk to your judge that sent you, bro. Do not interfere. Then I'm going to talk to the judge that sent you. Get out of the roadway. Get out of the roadway. Bag up. I do not want to place you under arrest. Bro, if you do don't bag up. I do not want to place you under arrest. You understand me. This is not my property. Do you understand me? This is not my property. They are towing your vehicle. They ain't doing nothing. Traffic service officers are towing your vehicle. I do not want to place you under arrest, but I will if I have to. I don't know how many chances I have to give you, but I, I'm this close to placing you Assault under arrest. Me. Assault under, me. Placing you under arrest. Assault me. Then you ain't gonna have a job. I don't know so, if you got family and kids because you're not gonna be supporting I'm not gonna assault you, but I'm gonna use soon my as power you touch me, within the law. The power is an illusion. As soon as you touch me, you are under arrest. Look, bro. Do you understand? Look, bro. Now what you gonna do? Get out of the car. Get out of the car. I can't be parked. Get out of the car. Come open the door. Get out of the car right now. I'm going to get out. How many times do I have to tell you? I'm going to get out. Turn the car. I'm going to get out. Hey, 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 hey. Listen, comply with my instructions. Comply with my instructions. Hey. Come get my phone. Right here. Hey, hey. Right here, right here. Now do you guys see why I always advocate that more science does not benefit anyone's life? All of this nonsense, and now this man is going to jail because of his ignorance thanks to Morris science. Ladies and gentlemen, please do not do Morris science. Hey, let's go. Hey.